Let me do it. I don't want you blowing up the entire wall again. Sure. You could use the practice. Song's voice. He's in there. This crack is too small. I won't fit through. Let me try. Can't believe my rotten luck. Came here to raid a tomb for a bunch of foreigners. You're hurt. Are you all right? I'm fine. Thank you for taking care of the blood zombies. Those foreigners. I'll rest here for a bit. Here, take this flame stick. Might come in handy for you. Easy peasy, lemon squeezy. Told you we were gonna get lucky today. Since fate brought us to meet, can I ask you a favor? What is it? I got an old map from Pan's Antiquary. I'll see what I can do. The first time I laid my eyes on you, I knew you were someone who gets things done. And I... <laughs> you flatter me. I will be adventuring around the world. Hope we'll meet again. Wu Xie must have gone back to his shop to check his inventory. He owns a shop? Yep. Only the most famous pawn shop in Hangzhou. Wu's a... Sanxing are dressed in this photo. 
You seem to be a member of the Nine, too. Maybe something happened that caused you to lose your memory? That explains why you were so at ease in the tomb. You're practically another Chi Ling. Me? A member of the Nine? Studying the Fox Mask might take a while. In the meantime, get yourself acquainted with the Nine. We're suddenly seeing a lot of foreigners in town, running around buying antiques and artifacts. You know where this mask came from? I once saw something similar in a catacomb. That was my first raid. 